We're in the Hamilton Airport, and they have a cool little detour coffee shop like right in the airport through security. So there's two Tim Hortons here. There's one before security where you can get all your food and then come through security. And then there's another Tim's if you want that for a drink. But then there's also the detour coffee shop, and they have like proper good coffees. So that's kind of cool to know. We made it. We left at 2.30 in the morning. There are very few people I would wake up at 2.30 in the morning for, Julia Mercer, but we're doing it. We're here. We are in downtown St. John's now. Our hotel isn't a normal hotel. It's kind of like a boutique apartment building kind of thing, so they don't have a place for us to leave our suitcase. So we're gonna walk around with it for a little bit and do what we can until we get the email that we can put the bag away and go for more of a walk. But for now, we're still gonna try and see what we can and go down to the water. Did you fall down? Yeah, I did. <laughs> you got your sunnies out? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're over, that's uh, Signal Hill there. And then some beautiful big sailboat down by the bay here. So, I am currently sitting in the lobby of the Alt Hotel. We're staying at the Franklin Hotel, but it's, as I said, it's kind of a, uh, they bought an apartment building and don't really have a front desk situation. You kind of just get a code to get into your room. And we were early, so we had nowhere to leave our bags. So we came down to this Alt Hotel. They have a really nice cafe in the lobby. And the front desk staff was awesome and are going to hold our suitcase for us while we can go uh, walk around for a little bit. So very thankful for that because I don't want to drag around a suitcase, especially with the hills in this city. So we're going to go walk around now and uh, waiting for our friend Kayla. So we'll walk around with her for a little bit until our room is ready at the Franklin. Pretty good. The parlor? Yeah, it was good. Yum. Uh. <laughs> I'm ready! <laughs> all of our skates, all of our everything. Woo! <laughs> I know, just. <laughs> you sure you don't want a hand? I shipped my lockbox to, to Florida. Oh my god. <laughs> don't judge me. <laughs> Not everything. <laughs> Got here. Ooh, this is cool. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> she does everything. <laughs> well, hear ye, hear ye. Let's bring the Royal Order of Screechers to order. I hear we have some CFAs who want to be screeched in there tonight. Yes. Yes. Yay. <laughs> All right. So, for those of you who don't know what a CFA means, it's come from away. It oh, means from away. that's right. That means that you aren't born New Flanders, but after tonight, you'll be deemed quite proper honorary. Okay? Now notice how I said that, Newfoundland. It's not Newfoundland, it's not Newfoundland, it's Newfoundland. Okay, everyone try it now. Newfoundland. Okay. <laughs> CFAs arise. You gotta kiss the card, and I'm telling you, you better pucker up. Enough time for skin phone. Okay. Okay. So, okay. My name is Alex, and I is a Newfoundlander. Oh, pucker up. Oh, hey. You got this. You got a hold. It's gonna fall. Oh, I got hold it. Down here. Oh. Okay. 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 Signal Hill hike. 
hadn't really intended on it. I was doing the battery, battery road. I think it's called battery road walk. And then it kind of just turned into the signal hill hike. So I did the whole thing and it was spectacular. I have this beautiful weather and I couldn't not do it. So yeah, I did the whole thing there. Now I'm gonna go back and meet Taylor and Kayla for some breakfast and some coffee and to cool down. I saw the forecast when I woke up, it said 14 Celsius. So I put a long sleeve on originally and pants. Not intending on doing a hike up a relatively significant hill. Uh, but it was amazing. Definitely don't regret anything except putting pants on. But no, very, 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 very pretty and amazing weather. So yeah, back down into St. John's, Newfoundland. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. jam-packed our schedule for the last three or four days. So we just spent 48 hours in St. John's to see our friends get married, which was amazing, and I'm so glad we went. But now, um, we have a couple hours to get ready and pack for an eight-month tour, and we have another wedding tonight. Well, this video has been a little bit all over the place, which I kind of expected. Uh, so we just got back from St. John's, Newfoundland yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. Uh, had the evening here, started our packing, had a nice dinner with Taylor's dad. Now we have finished our packing this morning, kind of tidied up all the things that we could around here today, I think. <laughs> I hope. Uh, I think, again, everything is packed and ready to go. We are now dressed up, as you can see, and going off to one of my oldest friend's weddings this afternoon, which I'm very looking forward to. And happy we can be here for it because we leave tomorrow morning at six o'clock. We'll have to leave here to the airport to fly down to Florida to start tour. So this week has just been kind of all over the place, but it's so much fun, right? Running around all over the place, loving life and very excited to celebrate tonight with Michael and Brianna. So away we go to the wedding. I just wanted to note how nicely our suitcases fit in the trunk of Taylor's car. <laughs> They're just so perfectly in there. Right, well, we're at the London airport. Away we go. London to Toronto. Silly 20 minute flight. We're through security, which uh, normally we're smooth because we've done it so much. The TSA agents here decided to pull everything out of Taylor's bags, both bags. Both bags, completely empty. Bag one, and then, bag two, and like, took everything. They, they were so nice. They're like, can we help you put the bag? And I'm like, it's okay. And they're like, can we just put it anywhere? And I'm like, we leave for eight months. If it doesn't go in right, it's not going back in. Oh, I've never been more embarrassed in my entire life. But we were the only ones in security, so it was fine. Yeah. But I don't, that was really mortifying because I just finished bragging that both my bags were under 50 pounds or 49 and a half. And then all of my carry-ons were just, I think I had like 10 bins, like, everywhere. Spread. Awesome. Like, it's my knitting needles. No, it's a battery. I'm like, I don't have a battery. My ankle weights. My ankle weights did me in. Okay, bye. 